Hi, it's Trip, and it's time for another small eating or small drinking video. I hope you'll subscribe and like. So this is about the LaCroix drinks. LaCroix, LaCroix, LaCroix. It's pronounced LaCroix, just so you know. I looked it up and I want to try this two, three different ways this time just right out of the can which is this is a cold can already so it'll mess up the taste test in a little in a way because I'm pouring the cold LaCroix into a glass of ice like we drink everything in America, it's usually with ice. And this is just an empty glass. I'm going to pour it in there, but it'll have a different taste if it was just if it was just warm. So the United States we drink things, a lot of things, all kind of drinks cold, and even with ice, like sodas and things like that. Okay. In Western Europe they drink things just uh, in a little a little glass or a cup without any ice. And I wonder if somebody can tell me, what about in, in South America, Africa, Asia? Do you drink these kind of sodas? Do you drink sodas just in a glass hot? Or do you put them in a glass with ice? Or do you drink them right out of the can? I'm going to go ahead and try this right now. Remember, I'm a trained taste tester. Don't try this at home. I'm not responsible for the results. And if you're under 10 years old, then consult your parents or an older child. don't want it to be a real loud pop there. So I'm going to try it first of all right out of the can. LaCroix sparkling water. And this is beach plum. Not peach plum, but beach plum. Because life is, can be a beach. Can you hear the carbonation? Maybe not. But right up to the microphone. Hmm. Like I said, it's cold anyway. It'd have a different taste if I was if it if it was hot and I was drinking it with ice. I'll try it now with, with ice. Ice, ice, baby. A little more than that, let's be honest here. Enough to really give it a try. Well, it's so cold anyway, already. But I'm going to try it without any ice. Here it is, you can see it. Okay. Can you hear it? Probably not. You can feel the effervescence in your mouth. Let's read a little bit about it. I think I like it right out of the can. I don't like the cold drink in the cold with ice. I like it better out of the can or it seems a bit um, classier just to drink it out of the 
just uh, out of a plain glass without any eyes. It's a scammer. Yeah. Hello? Yep. Scammer. All right. I need my trusty magnifying glass. It has zero fat. Good. Zero sodium. Good. Zero carbohydrates. They're calling a lot today. But no protein. It's nice to have the protein, I think. I'm going to give them a call here. There's a number you can call. Two, four, one. They have numbers, so, you know, so we should be calling to tell people. Oh, hi, uh, you're in the, the makers of LaCroix? Yes. Yeah, is there some, is there like a comment line or something or a question line? Yeah. I have a question about the, the drinks here. I like the product, really. It's pretty good. It's a naturally, oh, I have a YouTube channel, so I'm recording this just for myself, and I'll make it later and we'll put it in the video. It's not live. Naturally beet plum, beach plum essence sparkling water. Can I ask somebody a question about it? Yes. How may I help you? Well, it says it has no protein in this. I thought protein was a good thing to have. Isn't that something that they could add to it? Protein? That might make it a little more uh, nutritious. Because it's not really nutritious. It's just a very nice little drink. But I thought maybe some protein would make it better. What do you think? I, I'm, I work in the consumer first department, so I'm not, I won't be able to answer any questions regarding in, ingredients and if, you know, if they will help make it healthier mm -hmm. per se. Uh, but I can, I can definitely um, take your comment down and uh, forward it to the correct department. Okay, it might be, you know, it might be a dumb comment. But, I mean, it seemed like they could add something to make it kind of nutritious and people wouldn't have to look on here, oh, well, there's no protein at all. Because I thought it was always a plus to have protein. I'm glad there's no sugar. That's wonderful. You know, and like for me, I'm supposed to, to be eating, uh, the doctor said I needed to have more, more protein. So, like steaks and stuff and this protein mix. And I just thought it'd be good to have something in, in, a, in a nice drink like this that was nutritious. Like protein, that's all. Okay, well, uh, thank you for your feedback. <laughs> thank you for t taking the comment. You have a nice day. You as well. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, that's probably the, f I think it's the first time I ever tried to do that. I mean, they have these numbers on there, and I told them I'm just a, you know, a guy with a YouTube channel, and I was going to record the comment. And I like the drink okay, you know. I mean, it's just a nice drink. It doesn't really have much to, as far as nutrition, there's really nothing there. It's not unhealthy for you. And I think I like it either right out of the can or in just a plain glass, but not warm. I guess that's all I have today on this. <laughs> I've sort of uh, beaten this horse to death. Can we say that on YouTube? I mean, it's just a an old saying. Could it be construed as cruelty to animals. It shouldn't. It's just a comment. It's just an old, an old saying. And that's it. And I'll talk to you all later. And thanks for watching.